I think most Americans have no idea how left wing this guy is. And once they do, uh, they'll run from him like he's got the plague. But of course, he wants to run for president. Uh, and he knows, however, he can't drop kick uh, Joe Biden because to do that means Kamala Harris is next person up. Uh, and he knows that if Kamala Harris is not the party nominee in the event that, that uh, Joe Biden cannot make it, Black women will be furious. Gavin Newsom publicly seems to be supporting Joe Biden, who's running for president. But privately, in his behavior, he seems to be running his own campaign uh, for president. Now, you lost to him in California. How do you think you'll go up against him or his, you know, supported candidate on a national stage? Well, the recall lost, um, and there was two parts to the ballot. The first part is 50% plus one had to vote to recall, and that part failed. On the replacement side, I got 3.5 million votes, more than virtually all the other 45 combined. California had 58 counties. I carried 57. The only one I lost was San Francisco. I lost that by 149 votes. This is the first time candidate. I hadn't run for anything since third grade. So uh, I don't think I lost. I think the recall part lost. But to answer your question, people don't realize what a loon this guy is. He just set up a commission so that if you are a fast food restaurant uh, owner, they're going to set wages. This is a guy who signed up for a commission to set up a reparations uh, a panel, uh, and that's, rep that's recommended so far around $350,000 for Black descendants of slaves. This is a guy who has banned the sale of new gas-powered cars by 2035, and then two days after issuing that, put out an, an energy alert telling people uh, who own EVs in California not to charge them during peak time. He banned gasoline-powered leaf blowers, banned gasoline-powered uh, gasoline uh, 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 mowers. He also is ordering large toy retailers to have a gender-neutral toy aisle. If you are a member of the LGBTQ community and you are a publicly held corporation in California, you must have at least one person from that community on your board of directors, even though it's very likely a violation violation of Proposition 14. He also is the one who appointed George Gascon, the soft on crime DA, as DA of San Francisco. He's the guy who drafted Proposition 47 that allows you to steal up to $1,000 a day. And if you get caught, they write you a ticket because you committed a misdemeanor. You have zero chance of going to jail because of the soft on crime, cashless bail policies of people like George Gascon, uh, the people that Gavin Newsom is back. People want something different, but they keep voting for the same thing. Um, you know, we saw this in Chicago or we've right. seen in California. It's like it just doesn't seem. And that's because they, they've trained the voters to believe no matter how bad things are, these dastardly Republicans will make things worse. That's why virtually every ad that ran uh, said, stop the Republican takeover. Nobody said Gavin Newsom is doing a great job for California. Gavin Newsom should have shut down the state the way he did. Gavin Newsom should have. Uh, kept kids out of school the way he did. Gavin Newsom is doing a great job on the budget. They never said any of that. They just said, stop Republican takeover. And we're outnumbered three to one in California, Republicans versus non-Republicans. And it worked. I think most Americans have no idea how left wing this guy is. And once they do, uh, they'll run from him like he's got the plague. But of course he wants to run for president. Uh, and he knows, however, he can't drop kick uh, Joe Biden because to do that means Kamala Harris is next person up. Uh, and he knows that if Kamala Harris is not the party nominee in the event that, that uh, Joe Biden cannot make it, Black women will be furious if they perceive her as, as to be kicked aside in favor of some white person like Mayor Pete or, or Gavin Newsom. So he knows that. And the first primary for the Democrats is in South Carolina. Uh, and Amy, 60 percent of the primary voters are black, most of those are black female, and they love them some Kamala Harris. I saw one number that put her numbers among blacks at 70%. It wasn't broken down by gender, but I assure you it's even higher among black females. And they feel that it's both sexist and racist for us to laugh at Kamala Harris' so-called cackle. <laughs> And they feel that uh, Joe Biden has given her a thankless task, like finding the root causes of illegal immigration. So they feel she's being picked on. And if she's not the, the party nominee, if Joe Biden can't make it, they'll be angry. Not so angry that they'll vote Republican, please. But they won't vote at all, thereby almost assuring that whoever it is we nominate, he or she will win in November 2024. And they can't run that risk. And Gavin Newsom knows everything I just now told you.